Well, we're about a month into construction season already, and some projects in our area have a city torn apart, like Washington Avenue in downtown Detroit Lakes, Minnesota. The street is being redone completely to add wider sidewalks and new utility lines. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop looks into if businesses are feeling the crunch of construction season. business owners are used to hearing just outside their front door. We've still had a lot of customers every day, even the days when there's been um, no front entrance and only the back entrance. Construction here in Detroit Lakes is about halfway over. The Chamber of Commerce says many businesses haven't felt the impact from the construction. They say that business is typically slower in May compared to the other warmer months. In the beginning, we were really concerned that with the road construction, business was going to shut down completely, but it's really stayed steady. Just outside the window of Becker Pet and Garden, construction crews started to tear up the road. The business has not had to deal with the construction until now. Scott Stonsengard says he is just trying to keep a positive mind despite the hassles it will bring. It's going to be a little more difficult to come in across the gravel, but I think people still will be able to get in here. A little more effort, but I think they'll be able to make it. Many shoppers walking around said they support the change. Very different. I've seen it, you know, on TV that they were going to do it, but I guess I hadn't expected to this degree. The DL mayor says downtown construction is expected to be completed by the end of June. The other portion from Frazee to Willow Street will be done later in the summer. The, the street's going to be done in, in, a, in concrete. So hopefully we're, we're putting together a 45 to 50 year street so we don't have to disrupt our merchants downtown for a very long time. In Detroit Lakes, Ashley Bishop, Valley News Live. Well, the DL Street Fair kicks off this Friday and Saturday despite the construction. This year, the fair has moved over one street to Lake Avenue and Holmes Street. And on Friday, come out to meet the Valley News Live team. A meet and greet is happening from about 11 to 1 p.m. Organizers of the street fair suggest parking in the mall lot and along side streets. Well, the city of Detroit Lakes and the Minnesota DNR have come to an agreement regarding the new development on Westlake Drive. The DNR was threatening to sue the city because they felt the development violated the Shoreland Ordinance. A new hotel, a restaurant, and condos will be built right across from the Deal Pavilion and Little Detroit Lake. And the agreement, the city has agreed to discussing changes to the city shoreland ordinance in the future. That, that came up in our discussion was possibly uh, having more flexibility along the most urban section here along Westlake Drive uh, in, in exchange for maybe more restrictive, uh, more restrictive ordinance on other parts of the lake. Mayor Matt Brank says the developer is also talking with the DNR regarding proper construction materials that won't impact the lake. Well, later on Valley News Live at 6.